Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to some more Kenshi with our Fogman only playthrough. Episode 14 with our series. We find ourselves all the way up north in the Leviathan Coast, where beak things and Leviathans just roam free and get the crap kicked out of them by gigantic packs of grues. All right, so that's that's where we're at. We're gonna keep moving. There's other things I want to explore in the Leviathan Coast. There's other things I want to see. We're looking for research artifacts, but uh, not just that. We're also looking for anything that's gonna help us be better at what we do. Regards to weapons, um, armor, anything like that. And if we can get stuff that we can sell to the skeletons for a little extra credits, which I haven't fully figured out what I'm going to do with that yet, but if we get something we can sell to the skeletons, that'll be good as well. I gotta say, I'm loving the Leviathan Coast, and I'm half tempted to make a base here, because <laughs> I feel like in terms of protection, we'd be pretty good, and food is easy enough. Um... And there's animals everywhere, you know, lots of possibility for trading, and we're going to need the animal skins at some point, because I guess that's what we need to make more books with the shatter, the torn books we got, or whatever they are. So that's uh, something to consider. All right. We're going to come in this way. How is everything looking home base, by the way? Fog prints. We haven't been home, so... We're running low on food. We'll have to find some we'll have to leave a lot more food next time or um, next time we're off in that area another group of tech hunters as well they seem to roam these the area fairly often which leads me to believe that there's good stuff around here because why would the tech hunters be so interested and hanging around this area if there wasn't anything valuable to loot. And there is a road as well. And I guess the stop nobody move means that Gru's are essentially Gru's are startled by like quick movement so Your characters will usually say that whenever they're concerned. Another group of uh, tech hunters. Whenever they're concerned that they, they might get attacked. This is a weaker group. Oh... Wow. I kind of want to make sure I explore this area over here. So why don't we send our our group up here real quick. Then I can send a runner down this uh, ridge. Because I want to make sure I don't miss anything. Well, there could be a ruin over here for all I know. Alright, Sir Camo. You've been called upon. Looks like, as far as I could tell, there's nothing around here, so we can go ahead and cross the water. Boy, there's Le Leviathans and Gurus all heading through the water. I just go around. And hopefully we don't get attacked. All right, here we go. Blood. 
I was really hoping there'd be some beak things. Ah, okay. We've got an outpost over here. All right. That's the stuff, too. And we can get this door open, but these two outpost areas we can search and loot. Let's go ahead and grab what we need here. The book, obviously, that's a guarantee. That puts us at three. And that book over there puts us at four. Tarsus, I'll have you come out here. Grab the skeleton repair kit. And the skeleton eye, probably the muscle too, that's what you got already. Skeleton muscles. Lots of money in parts. We're going to need electrical components at some point as well. I probably should be grabbing those. At least uh, having them on me. Right. There's another power core. Can't pick that up. All right, perfect. How am I going to split this up here? Because we're running out of room. Tarsus can probably drop a lot of this stuff off in uh, Billy here. Because he's the one that we're going to be sending to the the uh, oh my goodness, Black Desert City. He's got a lot of money and crap. I will say that. All right. Meanwhile, I guess I'll go ahead and trade with him because he's got the backpack on. So we'll just throw all the food in him. All of that can be eaten. Um, and he'll keep all of this. Electrical components and stuff I want to keep so we can trade with Bully. And drop all of that. All right. And there's other stuff here, like iron plates and everything. Like, this is stuff I would want. Just because you can never have too much, really. But I just don't dare risk it. Alright, let's get this door open. Okay, so that's what I thought. We got another group of security spiders that we've, we need to run. Wow. I didn't even, I didn't even stand a chance. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Cool guy, you're going to come. Give me a hand here. I need you to pick me up and then run for your life. Whew, that was insane. That door opened. They just smited me. All right, we're going to want to clear that out. We can pull them into a group of... Leviathans, maybe. All right, you better just keep me on. Keep me on your back for now. Let me get Tarsus. He's probably got good athletics. 74, so he can pull them and outrun them. The question is, where am I going to run them to? I can run them off to the side over here. Just to get them out of the way. All right, let's do it. Hey, that's fine too. Whatever you want to do, buddy. Oh, this is 
This could be a good or a bad thing. Let's see. We've got tech hunters coming down. There's a lot of them, and they're fairly strong. I think the security spider will do a good amount of damage. I think he'll lose, but... Oh, he lost very quickly, actually. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna have Tarsus pull a bunch of other security spiders right now before these guys run into anything else. Pull them. Come on, Tarsus. Pull them. Oh, uh, uh, we're getting hit. Ah, that's perfect. Got that one guy down. Tarsus took some, some beatings here, but... Oh, no. Actually, that, that's pretty weak. I think Tarsus can fight it. Oh, Jesus. Okay, who do we got on us now? Now that I got everybody pulled. Where is he? He is right there. Okay, it's just one of them. So let's go ahead and fight him real quick. Then we'll have some healing to do. Meanwhile, the security spiders fighting the Grooves. That's fine. Um. Uh. Here, Tarsus. Let's see. Definitely take those. And take the high grade armored hood. Who can wear a helmet that doesn't have one or a decent helmet? Penguin. There you go. And take some of these too. Oh, you've got five of those. Okay. Good. I'm going to run over here quick. I'm going to loot the beak thing. Get them cleaned up. And then this security spider's dying. The other ones are perfectly normal. We could probably loot this security spider, and then I want to loot these gurus. Ah, skeleton muscle. And I'll take the electrical components. Okay, here's more gurus. This shouldn't be too hard. Okay, we're going to put these guys on hold so this stops happening. Alright, these gurus will definitely take out these security spiders. They don't stand a chance, honestly. But a lot of the Grooves will die too. And that's not a bad thing. So there's going to be a lot of meat for us. And the security spiders downed even more. Perfect. It's exactly what we wanted. And I, yeah, electrical components. Because we could be a ways off from making our own. I really should be taking all the leather, too. If I had a... I don't know. I wish I had another bowl. We can come back up here. Not a big issue. We can always take a separate team and send them back up here. Just to search for stuff. So it's not a huge deal. Plus, a lot of it still stacks. And the skeleton muscles. Thank God for all this stacking. Alright, let's move quick. I want to get this guy looted. He's crippled. Okay. So, oh, he's going to go inside there, isn't he? Well, we can fight him regardless. No, he's not going to go in there. Well, I can loot and I can pull in more security spiders. That'll beat him up. And more gurus to fight him. Nice. Excellent timing. There's that and that, and thank you.
And I lost the other security spider. He... Chased after the sunset. I have no idea where he went. That guy's out there. I'll probably pull that beak thing or something. Okay, did we get it? Yep. Okay, nice. Probably one more upstairs. Oh, he got a nasty hit on me. Stuck on the door. There we go. We'll get him in front of these uh, gurus. Oh, another, the other one came back. Where the heck's he going? Guys are so weird sometimes. Okay. Jesus. You see, that's why I don't want to fight them. They, they will one shot almost everything. All right, am I up? Nope, still recovery coma. So it's going to be on Tarsus to loot this place. But we've pulled all the security spiders now. Ooh, except for the one that's coming in hot again. Why are they so glitchy right now? All right. Hey, go get yourself killed. That's fine with me. There's one more in the water here we'll have to watch out for. Uh, but we should be all set. Alright, we've got another book here. As well as some dried fish. Fish and a skeleton thing. We'll take the parchment as well, I think. Ah, there's Grog too. Alright, that... I uh, can't pick lock that, so we'll literally have to wait for my character to wake up. But we can take that. Nothing there. Um, that's also pretty good. It's all right. We're kind of out of room for some of this stuff. That's a problem. As much as I want to take it all. Ooh, that's a masterwork grade, and that's worth a lot. Good stealth and dodge effect as well. Yeah, that's really good. I'd rather take that and get rid of the my specialist grade assassin rags. Still recovery coma. Let me try something. Penwin. Wait a second. Penwin's got one already. Since when did he pick this up? Oh no, that's the wooden barrel still. Okay. I'm like, that's his inventory. I'm like, wait a second. <laughs> okay. I, I was freaked out. All right. Trade with the uh, bully real quick. Nope. Not you, Tarsus. I want you to stay there. All right, Penguin. Take the sleeping bag real quick. We'll make ourselves a little bit of a camp area. And then Kugai here can put me to bed. I can get healed up, so I'll be able to break into the safes and everything. We could probably cycle all our characters too uh, through that. Okay, so that'll have to be pick locked. I want to work on Tarsus's pick locking too. Tarsus's? Tarsus's? That sounds weird. Okay. These are all empty. Oh, yeah. So we want to take this. Uh, Tarsus can't take it though. Let's go ahead and pick lock this and we'll wait a little bit. 
we'll start getting his up. I need to have at least two or three people in the group that are decent pick, um, decent at pick lock. Well, lock picking. Boy, do I say pick lock? I say that all the time. Lock pick. Oh, that's why, because it's pick lock there. Yeah, lock picking. Oh, wow. <sighs> you really uh, did yourself in there, Tarsus. That's a great find. What is your lock picking, by the way? Nine? Yeah, you've got a long ways to go. Here you go. Why don't you go work on that one? A moon sickle and a really good one at that. All right. That's 8%, but that'll get you... Oh, hold on a second. Okay, 8%, but that'll get you a lot of practice. Nice. So once I'm done with the recovery coma, I'll head out and then we'll uh, have Penguin sleep a little bit and stuff. Some cats, okay, I'll take it. And a shirt that nobody can wear, but it's worth a lot, so I'll take that. By the way, I somebody asked me in the comment section. I never got a chance to... I, I commented back, but just so people who might be confused uh, know as well. And they didn't see my reply to the comment. I can't just wear regular shirts. Um, technically, the Fogmen are like part of the Hive class, right? So they got to wear Hive shirts only. It's just the way the game is. I know I can wear boots. It's, it's kind of it's just the mods. It's mods. Mods do weird things. So, nobody can wear, um, just regular shirts. Oh, triangle blade. Nice. Good, good weapon. It is a hacker class weapon, and it's a great weapon. Damn, we're getting some good stuff out of this run. We're going to have these bowls loaded right up. I'll probably send us another group up here. And I mentioned this before, but I'll say it again. I'll end up sending another group up here at some point. Oh, please tell me you can loot this. Holy crap, three of those? He's going to have to go outside to loot those two. Okay. Oh, a desert saber. There's good damage against spiders and bone dogs. He's got defense bonus. All right, and a pretty good heavy weapon. This is the stuff right here. All right, so all of that will have to be looted. We can go outside quick so we can loot this stuff. Wow, oh, I gotta go back in, then back out. Ugh. Okay, my character's up. So, I still gotta work on my chest, but I wanna go ahead and start looting some more things. Meanwhile, we'll have one of these guys get some rest. Maybe Penwin, Richard Scoops. Everybody's pretty good. Sir Camo could use a little first aid. Oh, we had a beak thing attack us. I wasn't paying any attention, but we took it down, so. Not a huge deal. We really need to start taking that leather. We're going to need it for all sorts of crap. So let's start stocking up on it a little bit. Now go ahead and provide first aid and then we'll have uh, we'll have you get some rest, Penguin. Yeah, if another beak thing comes down, we'll be good. We can handle two or three beak things. We just can't handle a whole herd of them, I guess. But our characters are getting pretty good. All right, and then my character will have to open the safe unless Tarsus can do it now. Nope, not yet. Okay, this is the other thing that I couldn't get open. Okay, the safe's going to have some good stuff in it. I can feel it in my bones. Oh, yes. These are good. Not as good as I was hoping, but... I can't complain. All right. I'll take that. I'll take whatever else was in here. Okay, the only things that are left are what's in the safe, which I do want. And my character needs to grab this because I want to wear that. But I'm not going to get rid of this because that'd be nuts. So I'll put that on though. Sweet, we look awesome. Oh, 
Okay. Not gonna worry about the steel bars. Is there anything else I can grab? I can't grab the triangle blade. I can't grab that. I can grab that though. And the three ch oh Jesus. All right, guys, let's go. Might as well get him down here. Tarsus, why don't you head upstairs? Oh my goodness, I got a sneeze coming. <laughs> oh. Sorry guys, time of the year. It is uh, pollen season, so my allergies have been nuts. Yeah, these are great. All really good weapons for our characters, especially Nadachi for Kugai here. He's using a much worse Adachi. 16, let's see. Yeah, it's a lot better. And then what was in there again? The huge cleaver. I probably won't grab that. I mean, I, I should grab everything, but here's the problem, guys. I'm going to tell you right now. We're running out of... Why are you he coming here? What are you coming to do? We got a random guy here, which you can fight, I guess. Yeah, we're running out of space, so I'm going to have to start deciding what I can and can't take. I... I can't take everything. We just don't have room for it. He's in the water. Yeah, well, he won't be in a second. Oh, he's decided he's not going to come in here. All right, cool guy. Come on. Go ahead and take that, please. Oh, it's an Odachi and a Nodachi, but they're still Katana class. Oh, that's a refitted blade. I'll just leave it. Oh boy, all right. And the other thing, do I want the pole hammer? It's pretty good. But I just don't have the room anymore. Tarsus, let's get you trading with the bulls. Stuff we're gonna keep. And then stuff we're not gonna keep. Am I gonna keep this? And this. I definitely want the Leviathan Slayer. A lot of you guys said it was pretty good. Um, that I'm not keeping. That's getting sold. But meat we're keeping. Books, obviously, we're keeping. All right, I'm just going to arrange this here. Put that there and that. Okay. Um, some of this is getting sold, sold. These can be stored if there was room. How about Billy? Out of trading range. Okay. These... Cargo pants can be ditched. Armored rags. They're not worth keeping. Even the high grade's not worth really anything. So let's make some room. Because if we don't, we're going to regret it. Is there anything on Bully that we are not keeping technically? I want the Bull backpack. The Robo pack can probably go out. I'd much rather put more weapons in here. Oh, crap. Oh, out of trading range again. Oh, my God. What a weird bug. All right, whatever. I've got room now for some weapons. Let me... Let me put the pole arm down quick so I can grab the bigger weapons. And then I'm going to decide who's going to get what. And then after that, yeah, because I'm going to probably re... 
space out these weapons a bit. Oh, the cross pull arm, the fragment circle, like this is all stuff that I want to keep for when we get more units. Oh my God. Perfect. Made room there. This stuff will get eaten up, so it's not a huge deal. Damn, we are geared up. Okay, what was the other stuff I wanted to grab? That was, I think, the last one. So we got everything from this place. I'm so happy we came up north and started looting all this. Some really, really good stuff around here. That one's good as well. Who is using these weapons? We've got you using a saber. Those that, that's a hacker class. You're using a katana, a saber. Who's using hackers? Katanas. Okay, Richard is. So come here, Richard. Let's get this over with right now. Sir Camo's using a heavy weapon, which I'll probably give him something else. Or maybe I'll let him keep the fallen. Fallen Sun. Another tech hunter. They're they're great just in terms of getting us certain things. Oh crap. Alright, we're okay. He'll do good against this guy. He's a pretty powerful tech hunter, but we've got him outnumbered. And that's where we're going to get him. Looks like we we're already getting attacked. I keep missing a lot of these battles. Oops, somebody lost their leg. Oopsie daisy. <laughs> this guy's almost down. Perfect. Penguin's doing some healing here. Ah, we got another one. All right. There, give Scoops a hand, guys. Camo, check and see what he's got real quick. Take his med kits. Oh, standard grade. I know I want all of this. We've got standard grade. That's shoddy though, so let's get rid of these. That's standard though. We'll take his standard armored hood. Get rid of that. You could wear the armored hood. See, we can't wear the shirt. Can't wear that. And the ring saber we don't care about. I kind of would like the standard grade mercenary plate though. I think armor is going to be the one thing I'm not going to have enough of when the time comes. That's all standard too. It's like free standard grade armor up here if we just fight tech hunters. And free med kits. That's pretty nice. What do these guys got? Get rid of that. High grade, high grade, standard. So you're pretty good. Penwin, you might as well take all this. That's what you're good for. But Sir Camel can still carry some of this stuff. Um, and then how about Sabrum? So he's still got some shoddy grade stuff. Which we're better off trading for standard. If we can get it. Not that though. If there's a helmet. Yeah, bandana is not really worth it. That's shoddy, shoddy. Standard. Was there not any pants that were standard? Like ninja pants? Scoops, go ahead and sleep. Okay, we'll be all right. Come on, Tarsus. And Richard here will go ahead and pick up the triangle blade. I'm just going to drop the flesh cleaver. I know it's a decent weapon, but... 
If I can be perfectly honest, we just don't have the capability to keep. We don't have room for all this stuff. That's a hacker too. But I'll have him use the triangle blade. Good damage for humans, pen armor penetration, stuff like that. It's a really good weapon. MK3. All right. I think we're ready to get out of here. Ooh, Anara, come on. What are you doing? Super far away. And your forearm, or your foreleg's damaged, but Penguin's got you here. So we're pretty, <laughs> we're pretty bogged down in terms of gear. So I can either head back or I can keep pushing. I have to, if I head back, I'd have to come back up. We got a little bit more room. Let's see if we can take a little bit. I might drop some of this stuff if, I mean, we're gonna eat some of this food here. Um, some of it can probably be dropped if we start, if we need room. Like the bull backpacks, I can honestly get a lot more of those. Um, I definitely need a third bull. Like the armored rags can be dropped because we can make room in here for more stuff we want to trade. Um, I've got stuff on me actually. Oh crap, I didn't grab the rest of those chain mail. And I've got a really nice saber here. Um, oh wait, wrong person. There. Yeah, I didn't grab the rest of that chain mail. I better go grab it, but let me... Who's using sabers? I think Penguin was using sabers. He's got a decent saber. We can give him a much better one. This saber's really good. So here you go, Penguin. Now you've got a nice saber. And the assassin rags, I want to keep. Um... God, we had the backpack. Let me give that back to me. We'll put the assassin rags on Bully for now. Oh, crap. Put it on Billy, I guess. Damn it. <laughs> there you go. Hold those. I'm going to go back and get the rest of those chainmail sheets. Take me a second. I'll cycle people out for healing still. Scoops is almost done. Is anybody like really injured? Sir Camo. All right, Scoops. And me, but I'm not as concerned. Oh yeah, the fragment circle. That's uh, what's his face? All right, we better take that. I knew I wanted to come in here and search one more time, make sure I didn't forget anything. Take those. That should be everything other than like armor plating. I'm not as concerned for. And I've got everything out of there. So we're all good. And then all of this, but we're not going to be able to take all of that. And none of that's really that important. So we're all set. Yeah, I want to make sure Tarsus has the right weapon. He must be carrying something that's not... Yeah, he's carrying that heavy weapon. Who is our heavy weapon user? It was Sir Camel, right? Yeah, he's using the Fallen Sun. He's got a heavy weapons of 22. The Fallen Sun is good. But it'd be better if we had something that was a little bit more... Um, a little bit more than just rusted junk. <laughs> this is MK1. It does 70% damage against robots, 29% against humans, 29% against animals, armor penetration 45, attack bonus of 8, um, blunt damage of 120. So, uh, I think we're just going to 
ditch the fallen sun. We can always make them. Uh, the scrapyard should have a recipe for it. Not a huge deal. All right, Camo, you're all set. Go ahead and dismantle that. And I guess carry it on, yeah? Let's keep moving. Richard's moving the... No, Sir Camo's actually moving the slowest. He's got a little bit of armor on him, plus the heavy weapon, but it's really slowed him down. He'll build up, though. He'll get up there in strength. So we'll have him lead the way for now. Coming down. I want to follow this road around. So we want to go all the way around this way. But holy crap, is there a large... Two large groups of beak things. There are a group of three and a group of five. Oh, and more coming out there. What's that over there, though? Beak thing egg. Oh. They're usually pretty valuable. That's actually the first beak thing nest I've seen since starting the game. Got a tech hunter fighting a beak thing. He's going to lose and get eaten. Maybe. Nope, actually he won. Just barely. He's probably going to end up fighting us. Yep. See if me and Tarsus can take him. Probably not me. Let Tarsus fight him. I'm going to run in and loot this beak thing quick for the food. This guy's really weak, so Tarsus will take him right out. Oh, the animal skin, Jesus. I really need it. I will need it eventually. Um, standard, standard. Take these two med kits. Uh, who needed these pants? Scoops did. There we go. All right, so we're going to cut off here since we're out of time anyways. Kind of uh, an eventful but not as eventful episode. Needless to say, there's still things happening. All of the exploring up north here. We'll continue going through the Leviathan Coast in the next episode. Um, just searching along the road, trying to find more lost armories and anything else that is up here. But I think we're only probably one more episode away from searching everything before we start making our journey back down. I just don't have any more room for material. So we'll probably head back to home base after this and then we can unload all of our stuff. We can get the new fog prints incorporated. Hopefully, I might actually do a little bit more um, recruiting and stuff down here. Try to keep that going so that way when my group gets back, we've got a nice group of people ready to join us. Although it looks like there's nobody here, so we'll have to put some people on the poles to get them here. There's random armor, but that's it. So we'll do a little bit more recruiting. I want to get some more of you guys in the game. We have a very good amount of weapons and ammo and armor and all sorts of stuff, so... That'll be good. Oh, and we've got a group of tech hunters. Yikes. There's a hive in there, too. we got a tech hunter. They're all fairly decently leveled. This could be a pretty tough fight. We'll save it for the next one, though. Thank you all for joining me. I hope that you've enjoyed it. I look forward to seeing you.
next time.